What up guys? Back at you with another Vita tutorial. Uh, this time I'm going to show you how to uh, um, uh, do a uh, fuel system leakage test, I guess. Um, me, m myself and uh, another friend, uh, Moses, have been having an issue where a code basically says you have a major leakage in your fuel system. Um, ev EVAP leakage, sorry, specifically EVAP leakage, not fuel leakage. Um, it's probably somewhere in the back. I was told it's either like the actual purge valve for this fuel system or the gas cap seal, which I already changed, um, or the ECU is being stupid. Um, so, uh, what you do is, I was just doing a tutorial for something else. Uh, obviously, you'll start at details and you go vehicle communications, sorry, vehicle communications and You'll first be at parameters, go to advanced, and you go to right there. Quick test of fuel tank. You go to, or you can just double click it. Zoom out. Um, obviously you need ignition on. Is there any, this is just gonna pop up the, like the current codes. And show you the whatever the hell it's installed for the latest software update. I don't know if that's true because this is like a bootleg version of Vita, so it's not updated. So I wouldn't really tell you if you do really have the latest version. Oh, I'm supposed to press yes. Damn it. So once you press yes, um. It'll show you all this info down here. It'll tell you basically, it gives you an idea of what the results should be. And you click this little ECU as always, or computer box thing. And you'll get this window. So once you click start, you can see down here, um, this is where this test results come up. Or I mean, this is where the test results come up. This is what the running status is. So once you click start, Right now it's testing it, and if there's a leakage, it should show minor leak, leak, or like major leakage, or system fine. So we'll let it run for, for like 10 seconds or something. We'll see what it says. I hear it clicking in the back. Sensors are doing stuff. Yep, major leak. And then you can just press stop. And I don't know, I, I've never tried to run it for a, while, for a long time, but um, that's how you do it. Um, then you just click start. It shows you here how much is leaking, I guess. Or the tank pressure, sorry. <laughs> there it goes, I heard it click in the back. And you just click hide. And it. you scroll down and it'll ask you what were the results over here basically what were the results for the fuel test or fuel system leakage test um mine was number one because um minor leakage found or major leakage mine was a major leakage if you have nothing you just click two or if you have if the test came unknown you click three um so i'm gonna click one because i have a major leak and then you click continue. And you're done. So that's how you know you have a major leakage in your system. Um, like I said, it's if you're having the same issue, it's you should try starting by changing your gas cap seal. Or um, if that doesn't work, obviously you're gonna have to remedy it with the EVAP valve which I don't know where it is on this car, but yeah, I think that's the, I think those are the only two locations where you can leak uh, gas, gases or fumes out of the gas tank. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching.